Hello everybody, it's Nateboy5499 here, and yo, a little, uh, we're on an adventure today, remember, we're doing a stakeout, we're gonna stake out Kanji, what's in the refrigerator, there's a chilled gulping melon, what, <laughs> yeah sure, why not. Less than a minute. Nice. Hmm. What up? They pretend they're in gangs? Blood or Crips, Nanako? Tell me. Because if they're Crips, we gotta leave town. We can't be hanging around with Crips. <laughs> Lols. Alright. It's Tuesday. Stakeout day, more or less. Yeah. Jump on him now. Boom. Kill that kid. Has the target arrived at school? Oh, jeez. Yes, ma'am. Visual ID confirmed. This is like military talk. Target arrived in zone near the end of his mess break, with mother issued rations in hand. What is Dojima lying in those bushes over there with a the sniper rifle? Like, permission to fire. Current status in the bathroom fixing his hair. The target was acting nervous. I left my position before he had a chance to pick on me. I wonder what kind of plans they made. It didn't seem like he knew that boy very well. See, Yuko's like, F whatever you guys are doing, I'm just gonna talk normal. That's why I like Yuko. something more subtle. Oh, he's here. Permission to fire. <laughs> Target down. That'd be awesome. Sniping minigame. I didn't keep you waiting, I hope. Oh dang. Slender young man. No, I, uh, All up in Kanji's business. What in the world was that? Pretty sure that was a man and another man. You know, hanging out together. What do you got against gays, Yosuke? You're, are you homophobic? Okay, anyways, we've got to hurry after them or we'll lose them. We don't want to lose them. Okay, then let's split up into two groups. Yeah. One team will follow Kanji and the other will stake out the shop. Me and you go staking out the shop, you know, hanging out together. That's what I say. Roger that. How should we split the teams? Well, me with Yukiko, obviously. Sure, that's fine with me. Yeah, she's like, whatever, I want to be with you. It's fine with me. You can go with your girlfriend. Oh, man, they're almost out of sight. Hurry on. So I'm pairing up with Chie? Okay. All right. We'll need to pretend we're on a date to make yes. it look Yes. Yes. Yes, Yosuke is, he has planned. He is the master. You can go, we're on a date. Uh, yeah. Oh, not in a million years. There'll be no need for that if we stay out of sight. Oh, Let's hurry up and go. Pretty sure the line says sheesh, not off. Oh, I wonder if those two will be all right. I don't know. There should be an option for me to just like put my arm around her shoulder and just walk. Uh, Charlie, make a move. Hurry. <laughs> Staking out. Staking out. We should just uh, go get some steaks, you know what I'm saying, Yukiko? Oh yeah, she's got me a drink. Sorry about the wait. This one's for you. Thanks, girl. Everything seems fine at the shop. I hope it stays that way. Do you think the culprit will come? Uh, no worries, girl. I'll, I'll protect you. Come on. Dang it! Why? Game, why? Do you think the culprit will come? I'm just going to keep my head in this so I can keep on hearing her say that Do over now. Do you think the culprit will come? Keep on saying that last word. Do you think the culprit will come? 
All right, this is done. I'm gonna, yeah. <laughs> we need to keep our eyes open. Yeah, sure do. It would be scary if the culprit did show up. I'll protect you. Don't worry. I got a golf do, club. I'll do what I can to help you catch them. Yeah, you, you will. Saved my life. I don't want to be well, the only one doing nothing. See, I got a little. I got to tell you a little something here. It was mostly me that saved you. So the other guys, you don't need to give them any credit. It was mostly me. If it wasn't for me and Izanagi, it wouldn't have happened. I mean, I'm sure there's something I can do. Zip. <laughs> oh, sorry. <laughs> what? I went on and on without realizing. I... You can talk for how long, ever long you want. Just keep on talking forever. That's all I want to happen. I've never chatted with a boy my age like this before. Girl, I'm older than you. <laughs> she, of course, has no problem getting along with guys because of her personality. But I think she's had more fun hanging out with you and Yosuke lately. <laughs> the same is true for me. Oh, look at her blushing. Look at that. Her eyes are like swelling up. She's gonna like get a fever and die. It's awesome. Social link. Blink. She is the priestess, I believe. Yeah, I know it. She's the priestess, yeah. I remember. The priestess Arcana. Charlie, why are you shining? Are you a vampire? That'd be awesome if Charlie was a vampire. Yeah, you could kill, take a blow for me. Yeah. You haven't asked her for our contact information. <laughs> Ask her straight out. I I'm couraged. I'm all couraged out. Oh. God, Charlie's a wimp. Oh, well, it'll probably still make her blush. Oh, you're right. We'll need to uh, contact each other if anything happens. Also, we can just contact each other anytime we want, you know what I'm saying? Since nothing's happened at the shop, you, uh, you want to go back to my place and uh, just chill? wonder what uh, Chie and Yosuke are doing. <laughs> what? Man, this is weird. <laughs> yeah, maybe, uh... <laughs> what? <laughs> yeah, we definitely stand out. <laughs> no, you know, it, it, it's totally cool. We both of you just... Yeah, what? <laughs> no, I mean them. I, I get this weird feeling about them. Weird? What about them's weird? Um, I don't know how to put it. Oh, well, maybe it's just my imagination. Hey, how do you think the others are doing? Probably close the same way that uh, we are right now, actually. <laughs> Beats me. For all we know, he's hitting on Yukiko as we speak. Yeah, I'm beating her up. <laughs> yep. That's it. <laughs> I'm hitting on her totally, yep. <laughs> I tried to. I He's couldn't. Like you. Uh, you'd be surprised, Chie. Yukiko doesn't seem to be interested in that stuff anyway. Cut to us, just like. Wait, are you <laughs> saying he's interested in her? <gasps> no, dude, don't. We talked on the phone, Yosuke. You said you wouldn't tell. If you do not rat out me, come on, dude. I wouldn't know. Yeah, you better keep it yourself, boy. You can get some of your legs broken. We don't really talk about that kind of stuff. <laughs> now I'm even more suspicious. You know something, don't My you? chair squeaking. Oh, uh, Yosuke, don't. I seriously don't know. It's not like we've been hanging out that long. Yeah, it's only been like two months. The hell are you two doing? Uh oh. This could be bad. Oh, well, 
You see, we're we're just two crazy lovebirds. Ah, uh, Yosuke is going for it. Uh, what do you mean, bird? <laughs> yeah, the love part. That's totally true. What do you mean, bird? We're not birds. We're obviously humans. Stay along, bird brain. Oh. Didn't I see you guys yesterday? Uh, no. <laughs> <laughs> Come on. It just so happened that we were walking behind you guys. Pure coincidence. Hey, our houses are just over that way, so we'll be going now. Oh, he's gonna run after him. Um, look, we weren't planning on getting in your guys' way, and, and there's nothing strange about it either. I... Strange? There's nothing strange about two dudes, huh? Got a problem with it? Why can't you keep your big mouth shut? Whoa, 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 wait. Damn it. <laughs> Run away. <laughs> Is that what you think? You, you got it all wrong. You got it all wrong. It's it, it's okay. Uh, I, I like girls. Are you listening, damn it? It seriously ain't like that. Yeah, I'm pretty sure she's probably a chick. I'm, I'm just saying. Back to us, making out. We regret to inform that our mission failed. I would not put up with this intolerance. Take a kick out my golf club and just whack him. There was nowhere to hide. Yo, we did our job perfectly. Yeah. Let's wait here a little longer. Maybe Kanji Kun will come home. Yeah. Uh oh. Don't turn around. What are you guys doing here? <gasps> Those stupid lovebirds I just saw. What do you mean, birds? We are not a couple. Why are you assholes following me around? What the hell's going on? I ain't saying this is you guys' fault, but damn it! <laughs> yeah, it's our fault that he has somehow become falling in love with a man, even though it's not a man; it's actually a woman. Hey, uh. Mind if we ask something? Has anything strange happened to you lately? What do you mean, strange? Huh? Strange? <laughs> You're gonna get it, Yosuke. It's this strange stuff, huh? Are you <laughs> saying that I'm strange? Huh? No, 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 I, I didn't mean... <gasps> you shitheads better get the hell out of my face! Whoa. I'm taking you down! Whoa. Uh, Charlie pulls out a golf club. Attack. Wait, why? I look like I'm joking! Maybe. It depends. Oh god, run! <laughs> Yosuke ran to the wall. He, as fast as your legs would carry you. It's like poetry, it's elegant. <sighs> Too much running. Well, nothing happened today, so I guess everything's okay. But it's already been a few days since he appeared on the Midnight Channel. If this is anything like Yukiko's case, it'll happen soon. Then we can't let our guard down. I think we should come back tomorrow to check up on him. Uh, why don't we just go tell him, watch out for people throwing people into TVs. He should be safe then. Looks like we've got no choice. He'll Let's probably get home. kidnapped tomorrow. Just saying. I can play my recorder and I don't know. Yeah, see me playing my recorder. I found it. It started raining. He probably already got sucked in the TV, didn't he, Nanako? Didn't he? You have you seen any bikers on the TV lately? Thanks for telling me that again. How long is it going to be raining for? Is it going to rain until the morning? It appears tomorrow's all sunny, so it might... No, it should, I should be able to watch a Midnight Channel tonight. Uh, let's just go watch a Midnight Channel. Uh, what? Can I just watch the Midnight Channel? Perhaps. 
Just saying. There you go. <gasps> it's the it's the murderer. Hello, it's Yukiko. I'm sorry to call so late. Why is she so out of breath every time she like calls the phone? Like, <sighs> it's uh, Yukiko. I'm uh, I'm doing some right now. Uh, just uh, just just talk to me. Just say say, say words. Oh my god. I had some calls to make for the end, so I called the textile shop as well. Uh when I spoke to Kanjikan's mother. Yes. She told me that he left the house and hasn't returned since. She did say that this happens all the time, but what do you think? Uh about what? <laughs> so, girl, I am stoned out of my mind. <laughs> this sounds bad. <gasps> Gay. What? It's going to rain again tonight. Maybe the midnight channel will come on. Yeah, let's just stay on the phone and uh, watch it together. You know what I'm saying? You care? Then we'll know for sure if something happened to Kanjikun or not. Yeah, let's just watch it together. No, 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 girl, girl, girl. Let's just watch it together. I mean, it's gonna come on in like a couple minutes. Just, let's just watch it together. Oh fuck. I love what Charlie didn't even say like one word besides for like sounds bad. <laughs> it was like, oh you got the wrong number. Uh, <laughs> uh I wanted to watch it with Yukiko. It's still raining. Something may appear on the TV. see something on the screen. It looks like your old house in Tokyo. You're inside the TV. Oh god. Hello, dear viewers. It's time for bad, bad bathhouse. Uh, what? <laughs> Tonight I'll introduce a superb sight for those searching for sublime love that surpasses the separation of the sexes. <sighs> oh. I'm just gonna say a bunch of S words to exaggerate my lisp. It surpasses the separations of the sexes. I'm your host, Kanji Tatsumi, serving you this scandalously special sneak in report. S -s scandalously special sneak in report. That's just a lot of S's. Goodness gracious, just imagine the things that might happen to me there. The funny thing is the voice actor for Kanji is the same dude that played Alex on uh, Red Faction Guerrilla. So if you play that game, you're probably like dying right now. <laughs> well then, let's get this show on the road. Toodaloo. Toodaloo. That's the best word in the English language. Oh, is it, what? I think I can see his butt. I don't even what was he wearing clothes? Oh, that was unmistakably Kanji. Oh, now I gotta go. Do that. Oh. We have to go save him. Uh, I'm wearing my ski jacket just for this again. You know that was awesome. Uh, uh, maybe we shouldn't save him. I want to watch the channel. That's what Yosuke is trying to say. He's too flustered. Listen, just calm down, dude. Calm down. Dude, it is past the 1990s now. It's okay to be a homosexual. Don't make fun of them. Come on, Yosuke. It really was Kanji. Yeah. Damn it, we guessed right, but he still slipped through our fingers. If only we'd held our ground and stayed there a little longer. <sighs> Why are you wearing your ski jacket again? It's like in your house watching the Midnight Channel, like, I'm so cold. Uh, he said the bad, bad bathhouse. A superb sight for those searching for sublime love? I just don't get it. The bad, bad bathhouse. Anyways, we better hurry and come up with a plan tomorrow. 
Now it's called Chie, or call Yukiko again. She'll be like, yeah, did you, did, uh, did you watch the Mina channel? <laughs> that was perfect for helping me. Gosh. Wednesday. Sigh. Given the pattern so far, Kanji's already inside the TV. Yep. I wonder what the Midnight Channel really is. I don't know, girl. Hmm. At first I thought it was one of those paranormal things, but when I gave it a try, it, it was real. It, it is real, yeah. Definitely. Turns out it's actually connected to another world. Another world. If there's a rumor going around, that means a bunch of people are watching it. The rumor go. If you stare into a turned off TV on a rainy night. Are you just now fig figuring this out? Like, how do you guys uh, see the match? You know, I, I forgot already. I, I didn't watch it last night just because of this. Ugh. No one in their right mind would try something that ridiculous, don't you think? Unless someone urged them to. But if you actually try, it does work. And not just once. If this rumor spreads and everyone starts watching the Midnight Channel. It could cause a huge panic. Uh. So homo. So the whole entire town is homophobic. It could cause a huge panic. Them seeing kanji like that. If Teddy is right, the missing people themselves create the stuff we see. So it's not random. It's specifically related to whoever goes missing. Sure. You could go at a show too, but she doesn't remember doing anything like that. <laughs> um, this might be a little off subject, but do you guys uh <laughs> do you guys know how to bake a cake? I was wondering. I was I need to bake a cake for some customers at the inn. <laughs> the culprit is probably watching the shows that come on, right? I don't see how this is off topic, but okay. No doubt, he's probably sitting back and enjoying. Uh, yeah. Enjoying. That's all you need to say, just enjoying. Yeah. Wait a sec, I bet he is enjoying it. <sighs> Alright. He's probably laughing his head off watching the show that comes on after he throws people into the TV. Oh, I get it. Yeah, it's definitely... Ugh. Now when I think of the killer, I get this image of a total sicko. I want to see everything about you, Yuki-chan. God, don't ever, ever do that again. Wait, so if people saw Yukiko's show, do you think people were watching what happened to me, too? Uh, well, I know I was. I don't know about other people. Oh, that is it! That killer is dead meat! I'm gonna leave footprints all over his face. I want you to do that to me, too. <laughs> Uh, why are you bending down? I don't understand. <laughs> First we save Kanji, then we crush the killer. Uh... <laughs> Chie, my eyes are up here, okay? Finally we crush the killer and send him to hell. Got it? Damn. <laughs> Still staring at my junk, are you, Chie? Well... Fool Arcana. Level three. <laughs> <laughs> Why is she laughing or talking about like sending this guy to hell and then she's just like, haha, she's like one of those girls that laugh at like like blood and guts like she's so like disturbed in the head she's like ha <laughs> he's getting his head cut off ha 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 oh Chie, those last two were the same thing uh yeah that's uh, hilarious i know gosh oh giant bomb best website ever Hey Teddy, someone's here, right? 
he's gonna turn around. It's gonna be like, it's gonna be like Mr. Moroka, like her. Oh, yep. I think someone's here. You think? Do you know where he is? I don't know. You don't know. I think it's a boy named Kanji. I don't know. <laughs> What's wrong? Not feeling well? Well, I sniff and I sniff, but I still can't tell where the smell comes from. <laughs> it's coming from inside your body. When uh, when your head got ripped off, Yosuke put a dead cat in there. Aren't you thinking too much about too many things? I mean, last time you were wondering about who you really are and how long you've been here. Your head's empty to begin with, dude. Don't stress out over stuff too much. You're right. Oh. Whoa, he's seriously down about this. If you can't figure out where Kanji is, we're in deep trouble. trouble. We can't just wander around aimlessly in a place like this. I know what might help. You should give me a clue about this Kanji person. Okay, well, he's in a place called the Bad Bad Bathhouse. He's probably a closeted homosexual. He likes to beat up biker gangs. And he wears a coat on his shoulders. It's just a feeling I have. Do you have anything that could give me a good understanding of him? That all should do it, what I just said there. Something about Kanji, huh? I can't really think of anything besides all the rumors about him. Well, then just say all the rumors. Most of them are probably true. Yeah, it's not like we know him that well. I just need some sort of hint. Something that tells me what he's really like. Gray hair. Probably a homosexual. Many things I can say. Why don't we ask around and find people who know Kanji Kun personally? Why can't we just do this? I want to fight. Urgh. Fine. I'll ask around town, and I have to go around every single person. Oh my god! We'll start in the, the shopping district. It's probably the best place. People that know him. What do you know about Kanji? Yes, this quest. I know. Uh, I assume I don't know about him. Okay, you're just a book, dude. You don't know anything. Oh, you might. Whatever. I'll talk to you, I guess. Yeah, June 1st. It's May 18th, so... Hey, what up, girl? The last people who... The last person who saw him. That would be that one boy that is actually a girl. Hey, do you know something about that dude? Biker gang. I don't care about biker gangs. So I'm looking for that boy that talked to him. None of those children know anything. Hey, Yosuke, you trying to get a date or something? Hey, girl. He's obviously not helping. Uh, I don't understand. I understand. I'm gonna become a good man. Yeah. Kind of, yeah. Ugh. Hey. What about you? Yours mother. Can't you tell me anything? A boy who taught to Kanji. What? What would that dude know? Well, this... It's his mother. Uh... Yo. Boy wearing a hat. All I can say is that I haven't seen anyone like that on the news. So have I activated the next layer of, like, going now? I have to ask about the boy with the hat. I don't want to know about you. What about you? He raised the saying he'll be here tomorrow. Okay. Yeah. Split up and look around for the boy. So basically, yeah, you 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 activate it layer by layer. 
you once you find out a little bit of information, and then all the dialogue changes for a lot of these people. You gotta keep on doing this. It's probably one of the worst parts of this game, I think. Just like before each dungeon, having to do this. But I mean, you gotta do what you gotta do. What do you got? Okay, so she's been activated now. Yeah, dude, biker gangs, totally radical. I don't care about girls. No, I'm not even gonna talk to you. Let's save first of all, because my game could randomly just crash and lose like 45 minutes of doing stuff. Da 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 da. No. Oh day. What are you doing, young boy? Alright. Let's go to the fl uh, river. There's probably no stuff down there. The floodplain. You seen the boy with the hat? You just talking to a bunch of people at Juness. Tuesday, Thursdays, and holidays. So, what? So, basically, you're saying I'm going to come back tomorrow on Thursday and see him at Juno's. Well, at least you're straight and concise with me. Let's look through here. Hey, what's up, Chia? You found anything? We're still looking for that boy. Look at the kitty. Hey, what up, bro? Uh, sure. More Romnu. Oh, the, the, that's a type of wine. It's very nice. Saki, whatever, same thing. Yeah, dude, I'll find some booze for you. Dude, yeah, dude. I got the hookup on the booze. Don't worry. I'll bring some right now. Uh. What do you know, boy? What do you know? You... Uh, yeah. Okay. What up, old lady? Alright. Let's go to the Juno's then, just to check. And then if nothing happens, then we'll go home. I don't know. You seen a boy with a hat? Alright. Well, there's nothing else to do today. I can just go home, but might as well do something today. You know what I'm saying? Let's just take down. I don't know. I'll look at the fox. Yes. <laughs> <laughs> Just Fox like, hey guys, you need the, you need some uh, leaves. When did it? Yo, Chia, listen, it's my, it's my dude. Don't worry, it's my dude. Whoa. Oh. Yeah, it's, it's a bib, not an apron. Okay, he prefers to be called a bib, but not an apron. He's not a cook. He does cook things, he eat, you know, brownies, but only, only brownies, but. Huh? Cure us with leaves. Are you kidding? <laughs> yep, yep, I want your money, yep, yep. What the hell? Yeah. It yipped again. But, but, uh... Then it really is something. <laughs> yip. <laughs> that's not a yip. That's a <laughs> no, yip. Gave a confident cry. What should we do? But... 
Let's take the fox in the TV. Hey. You know, dude, he can do whatever he wants to do, man. Just chase it away. Let's help it. Mm. Oh, wow, let's let it help. Take the fox in the TV. Put the fox through the TV. Oh. How's that even happen? You're just like, oh yeah, I got a fox. We're just take this in the TV. <laughs> this is awesome. Best game ever. Take the fox into the TV. Let's do it. Yeah, but let's just take down the castle. And also, I need to get that bottle of wine for the dude. Enter the TV, didn't I? I don't care! There's a whole nother dungeon we can be grinding on. Ugh. I had to just sleep the day away. We could be doing stuff today and grinding and getting up levels, but no, nah, we just gotta go home. Wait, is there a cat here of any type? Oh, there's no cats here. If there's a cat, you can spend time with it. It's awesome. Well, I can just tell people, hey, yo, the boy will appear tomorrow at the Juness. Listen, let's go on the TV now, though. Oh, whatever. Gotta go back home. Waste a day. Oh, I can hang out with Nanako. That's most certainly not a waste of a day. We're gonna save and we'll uh, we'll talk to Nanako on the next episode, right after these commercial breaks. All right, guys, have a have a have a have a good Tuesday if you're watching these on the day they come out. See you guys later.